Right now, the Senate is preparing for a procedural vote that could clear the way for passage of the immigration reform bill at issue, the new border surge amendment. Its sponsors, Senators John Hoven and Bob Corker, defend it as a way to bolster border security. Critics, though, are saying it should be handled separately from the citizenship issues addressed in the overall reform bill. The amendment calls for five steps to be taken before green cards can be issued to the 11 million estimated immigrants living illegally in the United States. Those five requirements are full implementation of a universal e-verify system, complete implementation of an entry and exit tracking system for visitors to the United States, the building of an additional 350 miles of border fence along our southern border, bringing the total to 700 miles of fence, and new technical, technological infrastructure installed along the border, along with the hiring, training, and deploying of an additional 20,000 border patrol agents. Senator Bob Corker, Republican of Tennessee, co-author of that amendment, joins us now. A lot of controversy about this, you know, in the press and among the public. What are you hearing from your fellow senators? Well, John, we're, we're obviously on the phone nonstop this morning talking with folks. And, John, I understand there are people that may have concerns about the overall bill. But tonight's vote is about those elements you just mentioned. I cannot imagine any senator that is serious about border security being opposed to this amendment. I mean, this is, these are the things that we have been striving for for years to have implemented. So why somebody who cares about border security would not support this amendment would be beyond me. And I think we're going to get a, a strong vote this evening because people are beginning to see that this is the case. Well, doesn't everybody in the end really care about border security? I mean, there isn't anybody who thinks we ought to just yeah. continue with the, the yeah. system we have where, you know, folks can walk across the border I, if they feel like it. I, I couldn't agree more. And this is the strongest border amendment I can imagine being in place along the border. You know, John, I used to build shopping centers around the country, and it was really tangible. Uh, when I completed the center, people knew it, and I was paid. What we've done in this amendment is made it very tangible. 20,000 Border Patrol uh, agents trained and deployed on the border. Another 350 miles of fence, which Republicans have been pushing for for years. An entry-exit visa program in place, in place, E-Verify, in place. $4 billion of technology that the Border Patrol has been asking for for years has to be deployed and in place. So we've put those tangible triggers in this bill. I, again, if you're serious about border security, you would vote for this amendment. Let's talk about the A word, amnesty. A lot of people are saying, oh, it's amnesty, is it? Well, this amendment doesn't address some of the other provisions of the bill that people have concerns about. This bill is about border security. And again, if you're, I know your constituents are concerned about border security. I went to get a hamburger Saturday night in my neighborhood and everybody there was concerned about border security. But if you're concerned about border security, this amendment is one you support. There may be other issues in the bill you don't like, but certainly it would not be this amendment. Senator Bob Corker, Republican, thank you very much for joining us. We are going to continue to watch uh, your bill as it proceeds through Capitol Hill. Thanks very much for joining us.